Hello, this is Kristen Coleman, and I decided to do my executive leadership project on someone we all know, Sean Corey Carter, also known as Jay-Z. Throughout this presentation, I will tell you a little bit about him. He is also in my PLN network. I follow him on Twitter at S underscore C underscore. Jay-Z is an American rapper, producer, and entrepreneur. He is known as the most financially successful hip-hop artist and entrepreneur in America. His success includes him being one of the greatest rappers of all time. Fredro Starr was noted saying that he is the master of flow. He can rap fast, he can rap slow, but his verses are always memorized by many of people. So is he the best rapper alive? I would agree so. When you have sold over 50 million records worldwide, who can argue with that? When you hold the title for the most number one albums by a solo artist with 11, that should tell you that you are the best rapper alive. Jay-Z also has 13 Grammys, as well as other nominations and other awards. But everyone know in the music business, winning a Grammy is a very big deal. And he has 13. I already told you guys how he has 11 number one albums as a solo artist. How can you not say that he didn't shop chart charts? He owns Rockefeller Records, which no longer exists. He is the founder of Rock Nation, which has artists like J. Cole, who is the number one selling artist today, right now, and it also manages Rihanna, who is also doing her thing. Rock Aware, he sold that to Ionic Brand Corporation for $204 million, but he still oversees the marketing. He also owns the 4040 Nightclub, which is located in New York, Atlantic City, and Chicago. He has plans on making one in Singapore and Tokyo. He is the co brand director for Budweiser. He also plans on opening 4040 bars in 20 airports. Not only that, he's moving the New Jersey Nets to Brooklyn. There is an arena being built in Brooklyn as I say this to you. He is partially the owner of the New Jersey Nets and he is moving them to Brooklyn. So, is he a businessman? No, he's a business himself. Watch the Throne is an album that him and Kanye West has just released. Ranking in number one. Already went gold. With plans on going platinum before the year is out, everybody can see that. The Watch the Throne tour is underway. They think that they will make over a million dollars per show which is not unusual for Jay-Z because his concerts always make a million or more per show. So him and Kanye on tour together is a powerhouse move. Jay-Z also has invested in Carol's Daughter. For those who do not know what that is, it is a brand that has skin, hair, and hand products. Jay-Z is worth $450 million, which makes him number two as a hip-hop mogul on the Forbes list. President Obama says that every time he talks to Jay-Z, who is brilliant and has much talent, he's a good guy and he loves talking to him. Irv Gotti also said the same thing about Jay-Z.
They love him. His mind is beyond head. He always has good ideas and always reaching out to help others. That is why he is a person that I admire. Not only because he came from nothing to something, but he always has innovated ideas.